Alrighty, what do you say we jump straight into this? This ought to be spicy. <laughs> I love the ghost ship angle. I, I'm going to ask again because a lot of times when I ask questions in the middle of reaction, I don't ever get responses. So I'll ask it here as well. Is the ghost ship thing, is that a thing in Japanese pop culture? Do they have ghost ship stories? Maybe they do. Being a seafaring nation, I would think they would almost have to. So, yeah, I mean, you know, that's that's my question. I guess they do. And maybe I'll, I really want to get into some horror anime this season. You know, this... Uh, this being the Halloween season, as you watch this, I'm recording this in August. So sometime between the time I record this and October actually hitting, I'll probably do some horror anime, get it out there, see what people think. Should be fun. I'm really into horror. I like horror. But we'll see how it goes. In the meantime, you know where we are. You know where we're going. It's not a black screen this time. Excellent. Three, two, one. That's right. Light them up. Light them up, fellas. I wonder if this may be the whole 10 episode arc, right? The 10 episode filler thing may be just this one arc is what I'm trying to say. It's probably easier to write a 10 episode story than 10 one episode stories, I would think. Navarone. You think that's a reference to the guns of Navarone? It's almost got to be, right? Fortress. He draws inspiration from everywhere. I bet, I bet he draws a lot of his inspiration from history. I bet that that's a reference. They're doing new shots, too. I like this. Yeah, <laughs> shut the hell up. This is where the ghost mythology came from in the first place. <laughs> yeah, look at him. I'm terrified, sir. You would think military people would be braver, but apparently not. <laughs> That's right. Get your damn clothes on, idiot. <laughs> Get your ass out of here. We ain't got time for you to tie your tie. Why infiltrate the fortress? It's one of the biggest fortresses around, apparently. It's probably something that got referenced in the manga that they explored in filler. Yeah. <laughs> Dumbass. Maybe you should get some rest. It's been a long, it was a long arc up there in the sky, right? The tow in the ship. Well, that sucks. Where are they taking it? It's going to be a lot harder to get it out now. Not really, though. You just kick everybody's ass in sight until they leave you alone and then you take the ship. <laughs> we can't come and help you anytime soon. Yeah, we can't spare any men right now. Really? You just undercut everything I say, boss. I can't stand for this. I mean, that was the only choice, really, if you think about it. You got to give him medical attention, man. Yeah, so, like, this just confirms what we already knew. They have a sea gate and people from outside can come in, obviously, right? Why would you build a fortress that nobody can access? There'd be no point in it. They can when they b b bust through that gate. Those are the wanted posters, yep. I was about to say. <laughs> first degree alert. Well, la ti da. <laughs> Not the first degree alert. So, you're telling me he don't know what direction to go. It's probably built to be confusing. She's the only one who would try to make sense of it, by the way. Being a navigator. Map maker. Everybody else would just be wandering. They wouldn't really try to make sense of it. Is 
She's always so sneaky. <laughs> Does it look like the Golden Gate Bridge to anybody else? It kind of looks that way to me. It's not really a bridge, though, I don't think. It feels like a support structure. Yep, we're screwed. Why don't you shout later, louder? Oh, your gold is gone, man. Now, how are they going to explain the gold being gone when we get to the canon stuff again? Because in canon, they have the gold still because this never happened. So they're going to have to recover the gold somehow. There she goes. She wasn't sure. That's good news. <laughs> She's wearing evil on her shirt and she had an evil look in her face when she said that. I like it. You better have a uniform. They're about to bust her ass. Yeah, she can mingle, but she needs a uniform. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Very confusing, isn't it? <laughs> no idea. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I tell you what, she turns on a dime. She turns on a dime. You don't know where the kitchen is, though. Why do you have pirate tattoos? See, now they're going to expect her to take her, her to take them directly to the kitchen, and she can't do that because she don't know where the hell it is. You should have just said, you should have got rid of them somehow. I don't know. I just got here myself. If they knew anything about it, they wouldn't be lost. Oh boy, this is not good. Yeah, I like that little giggle. <laughs> Still not as good at cooks as our boy. Yeah, <laughs> you don't know where the kitchen is. Yeah, <laughs> she knows how to play the game. There you go. That's how you get rid of them. That's how you get rid of them. That was brilliant. I don't know that I would have thought of that. By the time you look around, she's gone. Yep, that's how you get rid of her. Besides, you know, she, she's busy. You would assume. So she, of course, is not going to walk you the whole way. I didn't even think about that. That was actually brilliant, man. She's really cunning, which is why she has a high cunning score. I assume that once you said you knew where it was, you would have to walk them directly to it, right? <laughs> you better be scared. He will kick your ass. He also has a three-fifth style. <laughs> you dumbass. Idiot. He deserves his ass whipping. Kick his ass. <laughs> I'm used to abuse from you, so it's okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. How are you going to hide the swords? <laughs> he needs his damn swords, man. Follow them to the kitchen. That's what I'm saying. She can't. He can. That's what always happens. We get lucky. <laughs> He's a lot more chill than she is. Because she's smarter than him. You notice that dumb people are never really overly anxious? Because they can't think out the implications of what's going on, right? <laughs> Boy, you better not throw his swords away. The hell are you doing that's what I'm saying. Give me my damn swords back. Oh my God. Are you shitting me? Unbelievable, man. Gotta be careful with those things, man. <laughs> You're supposed to mop out the latrine. <laughs> Apparently his uh, bandana says uh, on, uh, group leader or something. You 
you guys are screwed. <laughs> they're going to be in the dining hall, which is where the people are going to be looking for them because they've already said that. <laughs> but he's always rash. I thought you knew. <laughs> Kick his ass. <laughs> you dumbass. Busted. Hey, man, how'd they get up there so fast? It's not like they can turn invisible. What happened? Oh, I see. Yeah, you better hold his mouth. Yep, that's better. Yep, let's go eat. Since that's the only thing on his damn mind, by the way. Eventually, those cooks will find their way here. Oh, wow. Why they got to be assholes? Damn. That is harsh, man. Damn. These guys ain't screwing around. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> you know what? I believe that about him. Full power carbohydrates, dining hall, something like that. It went by fast. They're going to look like the new cooks, aren't they? Shit. Yeah, sure, why not? Wait till the Murray brothers actually get here. That's going to be a damn problem, man. Oh, boy. This... <laughs> This has been a fun story, man. Why, man, people would be hating filler. Just y'all some hating asses. I saw a Naradu filler that was absolutely effing horrible. Their filler is always good. Like, there's only been a couple filler episodes I thought were trash. Only a couple. This is good, man. Excreting? Damn, dude. That's I don't really want that sentence that, coming from a cook. Yeah. <laughs> Get me fed, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> That's why they showed her earlier. She's going to kick their asses. Yep. Yeah, it looks good, man. Imagine this reception going to the actual Murray brothers. They'd probably be talking shit. What are you going to do? At least Sandy can cook. So Wait, that's not Sandy, is it? No, it is. That shows how, like, he fades back in my memory. The only one I was remembering was in the room was Luffy. Yeah, so we know Sanji can cook. So it's just uh, Luffy can't. So how are you going to do that? How are you going to play this off? <laughs> I like it. Good shit. You ain't eating shit. He's up to the task. Just get me to the all blue sea. I'll show you some cooking. Look at him. Yeah. He ain't worried. Yeah. <laughs> How about I teach you? <laughs> He's up to it. I, I can see what she's putting down here. Satisfy you, huh? Phrasing. Phrasing. <laughs> Here's where he shines, when he's not simping. Although he probably will simp for her. Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> Interesting. See, Luffy can't pull this off. <laughs> it is exciting. <laughs> Look at it. That's right. He's about to kick your asses. Not good enough. So you're going to waste food is what you're telling me. Look at it. He's not even starting. 
I'm giving him a head start. He ain't admitting nothing. Yeah. Look good. Wait, is it raw? There's no way they're already finished. <laughs> what are you guys, a boy band? Like, why are you coming in like that? Yeah, look at them. They did waste a lot of food. <laughs> He's going to use what they wasted and make a better meal. That's what I'm saying. Badass. I don't know about the tuna head. That's right. Look at him. He's working his magic. Hell yeah. I don't know about vegetable wastes, but you know. Oh yeah. Well, they made some dumplings. This would take hours, of course, but you know. Oh shit. It's getting me excited. Look at him, man. He was born for this. Shouldn't have been talking shit. <laughs> yep. Nutrients. Yeah, he is a good cook. We got to give him that, right? Yeah, yeah that's right. Awesome. A la carte. That's what I'm talking about. Chump. And it tastes delicious. Now, step up again. <laughs> he knows how to work the garbage. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. He wastes nothing. Oh, he loves the food. That's kind of sweet. <laughs> Look at him. He's trying to score. <laughs> Good shit, homie. Yeah, <laughs> let her try one of them, man. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I thought, man. Dumbass. Idiots. She likes it. She didn't even try the food and she knows he's awesome. Yep, you should be ashamed. <laughs> He's eating all the other ones, the bad ones. Yeah, <laughs> I'm getting rid of the refuse. Yeah, <laughs> look at him, put it away. <laughs> Seems like a waste to me. Well, at least he finally ate, so he can stop bitching about eating for five minutes. What? You ate too much, man. <laughs> uh, good. You can stop bitching about being hungry. He gets annoyed with that. Yeah, I regret nothing. We're out of here. <laughs> Consider yourself pwned. And now the real Murray brother's about to step up in here. <laughs> That's not what she's asking, dumbass. Yes. <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> that will be acceptable. We'll never see you again. <laughs> Dumbass. They're, also, they're pirates, but they're also ghosts. They're like ghost pirates. We haven't seen Chopper all episode. We're also missing Nico. Hmm. Then there's this idiot. <laughs> That was idiotic. Why did she do that? They're going to fall again, aren't they? It's going to piss me off. He's holding by one finger. Yeah. <laughs> Dumbass. Oh, my God. 
He just can't catch a break. If brains were dynamite, he wouldn't have enough to blow his nose. At least he doesn't have the uh, fruit power where he couldn't swim. <laughs> I love his uh, fishing animation. Crap. Well, that's not good. I don't believe for a second he's going to die in a filler arc, but still. I don't think he's going to die in a regular canon arc either, but yeah, that's how you get out of that. Yeah. <laughs> Give me my damn swords. <laughs> Shit. Well, this is awkward. <sighs> damn it. Yeah, and they're going to capture his damn swords. So now we're going to have to go through that and try to find them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> This can be a very confused Jessica. <laughs> when those two finally, however long it takes when they finally make it to the kitchen. I bet it'll be the end of the story arc when they finally make it. We're going to see them, randomly see them wandering around in the background and stuff. And finally at the end, they'll get in there. All right, well, that's it for today. But tomorrow there'll be two more episodes.